good, YouTube? In today's video, I want to talk to y'all about Stephen A. Smith. Stephen A. Smith went on first take, and he had called out Luka Doncic for taunting a ref. I'm starting to notice a lot of these sports analysts is calling out players to be fined a lot more, and I'm not sure why is that. Like, is these guys in the bed with the NBA now to try to get these players fined? I'm starting to just notice a lot of these sports analysts is really trying to make things an issue. Like when Skip Bayless made this tweet about John Morant, Saying that, oh, John Morant sung a song in his homie's post game interview promoting gun violence. And it's like these dudes is trying their hardest to make something an issue just to have a topic to talk about or just to try to get these guys fined or spark some backlash and be like, I told you so. And this is what I did. And I'm just noticing this a lot from covering these guys. So, with that being said, man, I want to highlight this video. And I'll be right back with a little bit more commentary. Here's a video. Be sure to hit that like button for me if you haven't already. That helps this YouTube channel continue to grow. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Stay up to date with all of my current YouTube videos. Peace. And I tell you where you I tell you what a big problem should be. And I'm gonna I'm gonna be a left here, Jay. The big problem should be with Luca Doncic. And I love Luca. But when you when Draymond contested that last layup that he missed, and then you go like this to the officials, you are implying something very, very heinous. And if I'm the commissioner of the NBA and I'm the league office, I place a call to Luka Doncic. Do that again, and automatic suspension is coming your way. You can't do that. You can't do that. We know the times with Tim Donaghy and all of this other stuff. We know the history. You know, you, you, the NBA has put forth a tremendous effort to make sure that everything is on the up and up. You cannot have a star player looking at an official, you understand, with the age of gambling infiltrating the proceedings to some mm -hmm. degree because the sports are involved with gambling and all of this other stuff. You can't have a player because an official misses a call and he goes to the official and he's going like that. You cannot do that. That cannot be tolerated. You have to shut that down immediately. That's a bigger issue than anything that we're discussing right now. That has to be stopped immediately. So, yeah, man, that's what Stephen A. Smith had to say. And you notice how he tried to emphasize that he's an NBA star and he shouldn't be doing that. And it's like, man, if he feel that way, he should be doing that. If the NBA wanted to find Luka, they would have already done it and they would have did it while he did it during the game. You know what I mean? He would have got teed up a fine or something. Like, it would have been reported after the game. So the fact that Stephen A. Smith want this man to get fined for something that the NBA is not even finding players for, I just find it crazy that Stephen A. Smith is just trying to make this an issue. But, yeah, man, I just wanted to come on here and show you guys that because we got to watch out for guys like Stephen A. Smith because he will continue to use his platform to go against players and get these guys fined, lower their contracts. He is the main key guy to get these guys to lose money. But that's just my opinion, man. Leave a comment down below. I would love to hear y'all thoughts on this. Do y'all feel like Stephen A. Smith is wrong for doing that? Or do you agree with Stephen A. Smith? I would love to hear y'all thoughts. Salute if you made it this far in the video. Don't forget to smash that thumbs up button for me if you haven't already. That helps my channel continue to grow. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're new to my page as well. Or if you've already been around to the page. Salute, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. And we out, man. Peace.